you. We're also joined tonight by KCTV 5's Betsy Webster, who has actually spoken with neighbors and others who knew the family tonight. And Betsy, we understand this whole thing may have something to do with a divorce. Well, I'll tell you that when we checked court records here at the Leavenworth County Courthouse, we did find information about a divorce. The, some neighbors that I met, they choked up when they talked about the kids. These were kids who played with their own children. They were grateful and relieved that the little girls were found okay and saddened and sickened about what happened to the boys. They say the couple was separated but had been trying to work things out. Those court records show that Donnie Jackson Jr. filed for divorce from his wife, the mother of his children, in August of last year. They had a hearing coming up next month on November 12th. And just last month, Donnie Jr.'s attorney withdrew and he began representing himself. A neighbor said that the boys lived with him at that home, that rural home where Greg was just reporting and the girls lived with her in a home in Lansing. But they say that Jackson, Donnie Jackson Jr. came to that house in Lansing often and was there as recently as Thursday. He also told me that in addition to those four children who were wrapped up in this awful situation, the couple also has a baby about eight months old. Reporting live in Leavenworth, Kansas, Betsy Webster, KCTV 5 News.